Hi, my name is Paweł Spechalski and I don't know if you noticed, but from time to time the midpoints and the endpoints on your radio are getting slightly off. Like in the beginning you had the midpoint at exactly 1500 microseconds and after a few months or a change of weather it got hotter, it got warmer, something changed around. Your midpoint is not no longer really a midpoint, it differs few microseconds. In theory it should not make much difference, but with flight controllers it makes some difference because when you're flying straight you're not really flying straight but slowly rotating. This is this is why why this is happening. This is happening because the gimbals and sliders and pods from time to time are just losing calibration. If you are not using Hall effect gimbals, then the potentiometers inside will wear off, the temperature might change the resistance of the potentiometer, there might be really slight, very slight differences that will result in the gimbal to slightly lose the calibration values. In theory, the Hall effect sensors should be should not be affected by, by that. In practice, however, even they from time to time suffer and you really might have to recalibrate the sticks again to be sure that everything is fine. How to do it? You have to go to the system configuration of the OpenTX. By the way, this is the global. If you change the calibration of the gimbals or potentiometers or anything else, this affects all of your models. And when you should do it, only when you feel that the calibration is really, really, really off and manually, and you constantly have to correct the midpoints in the, in the output tab over here. So, how to do it? Or how often to do it? I usually not more often than once a year and definitely right after you got your new radio. How to do it? Go to system and use page button to navigate to the hardware and there is a position called calibration. Just enter the calibration. And now the screen will more or less tell you what to do next and you have to press enter to start. So let's press enter and now very important step. You have to move all the sticks and all the sliders over here and over here and all the potentiometers and also multi-position switch in this very specific case to the middle position. If you will not move throttle to the middle position it will go crazy. So now all the sticks are centered, we press enter again. And now the funny part. You just do like you just do something like that with every gimbal, every potentiometer and every slider. If you have the jumper TX and you are using this thing, also with the six position switch. After doing that, like always, press enter. Dadam! You just calibrated your sticks. There is nothing else you have to do. And now, if we will go to the monitor, okay, let's go to the monitor. So they are nicely calibrated with nicely, at least usually, nicely stored midpoints, and there is nothing else for us to do. So if once a year or two, or three, you feel like your gimbals are slightly off, especially when you have the cheaper potentiometer based gimbals, the calibration is something that you really might want to do. But if everything is working perfectly and this is not a new radio, usually there is not such a need. That's all for today. Until the next one. Bye bye.